Hi guys, it's Frank here from Retro Barber Shop in Limerick. Today I'm going to be doing a skin fade with a textured crap on top on my model chain. Hope you enjoy it. Okay, first off guys, we're gonna use my wall magic clip. Uh, we're gonna take this about a quarter of an inch above the temple area, starting on the left side, working over to the right side. Using your mirror, mirror all the time, just checking the balance of the haircut. Now that we've got a baseline in, I can switch over to my Andes foil shaver. So we use this to get it really tight down to my skin fade, and I bring this up about maybe just about a quarter of an inch short of the baseline. I really like to use the Jack and Dean military brush or something similar, just to brush away any loose hairs. So now I switch over to my wall T-cut to fade out any, any lines created by the foil shaver. So now we go back to my wall magic clip with the one blade open and we go about a half inch above the baseline. So now we go to one blade closed and go about a quarter of an inch above the baseline. So now we go to zero blade open or your half blade and you just take this just above the baseline. So on the front section we point cut the hair, taking the hair at a 45 degree angle using the point of the scissors and this will remove bulk and add texture to the hair. Another technique I like to use um, for adding more texture is my point cutting over comb. Just run through the top of the hair, again just for more texture. Just moving back into the sides, I use tin and scissors over comb. And this helps blend and remove any weight and also connects the sides into the top. Just to add a little bit more texture on top, I just take random sections and using my thin scissors just slice through the hair just to give a little bit more movement. So moving back onto the sides, I use my wall magic clip with my one blade open and then closed just to taper down a little bit more just to get a smoother finish. Now I switch back to my wall super taper, even on a zero blade to take out any lines that may have missed by the wall magic clip. 
Now switching back over to my 0.5 blade, using my Jack and Dean brush to take away any loose hairs, just to polish off any finishing touches. Okay, so now we use our wall clipper comb, and I like to use the T cut, the wall T cut, um, to do the clipper over comb technique, just to take a little bit more weight off the sides. Again, checking the balance all the time. some scratches with my wall beret. And just to give it some more detail, I just go over it with the cutout razor, just using the top quarter of the razor. It's nice and clean, keeping good tension with my left thumb. So just for styling the hair, um, I use American Crude Loose Powder and also just a small little bit of ADH Dry just for a little bit of extra hold. 